Over the last few decades, exoplanets, planets outside our solar system, have been discovered with orbital configurations that defy our understanding. Some orbit extremely close to their stars, completing a year in just hours. Others revolve around double stars, binary systems, such as the fictional Tatooine from Star Wars. Even a planet that revolves around a neutron star, something that was thought impossible until recently. In this video, we will see the five exoplanets with the strangest orbits of all. Let's get started. Number 5. K2-137b K2-137b is a planet that redefines what we mean by proximity to a star. Located between 264 and 355 light-years from Earth, this small rocky world orbits a quiet red dwarf star. So far, nothing out of the ordinary. But what is really amazing is the speed with which it revolves around its star. Only 4 hours and 20 minutes. Yes, you heard that right. A year in K2-137b lasts less than an afternoon on Earth. To achieve such a speed, the planet must be incredibly close to its host star, at a distance of about just 0.005 astronomical units. To put this in perspective, Mercury, the closest planet to the Sun in our system, is 0.39 astronomical units away. This means that K2-137b is about 80 times closer to its star than Mercury is to the Sun. At that distance, tidal forces, radiation, and heat are so extreme that any atmosphere has likely been wiped out long ago, leaving only a scorched, rocky core. Temperatures on this world's surface could reach values of up to 3600 degrees Fahrenheit, enough to melt metals and cause the planet itself to evaporate slowly. In fact, some models suggest that it is constantly losing mass, as if its star were slowly dissolving it, like a piece of butter evaporating over a hot pan. The most surprising thing is that K2-137b is not a unique case, but is one of the most extreme. There is another planet that completes its orbit in just over 4 hours, but K2-137b is the one we know best in this category. These types of planets are classified as ultra-short period and are an absolute nightmare for traditional models of planet formation. According to those theories, a rocky planet shouldn't be able to form or survive so close to its star, and yet, there it is. How did it get there? Did it form farther away and slowly migrate towards the stellar hell? Those are the questions that astronomers are still looking for answers to. The truth is that K2-137b exists. It defies the rules and reminds us that in the cosmos, there is always room for the unexpected. Number 4. PSR J1719-1438b Imagine a planet so dense and compact that if you could hold it in your hands, which is impossible of course, it would look like it was made of a single solid gem. Now imagine that planet revolves around a dead star, a neutron star, at breakneck speed. That's precisely what happens with PSR J1719-1438b, an exoplanet that has been rightly nicknamed the Diamond Planet. This strange world is orbiting just 600,000 kilometers from its parent star, a distance that is barely a fraction of the size of the Sun itself. To give you an idea, the Earth's orbit around the Sun is about 93 million miles. The one in PSR J1719-1438b is so small that it would fit entirely inside our Sun. And yet, in that tiny journey, the planet completes an orbit every 2 hours and 10 minutes, making it one of the exoplanets with the shortest year known. But its orbital velocity is not the most astonishing thing. The most amazing thing is its origin. This planet did not form like the others, from dust and gas in a protoplanetary disk. The most widely accepted hypothesis is that PSR J1719-1438b is the remnant of an ancient white dwarf, a star that was once normal but was stripped of almost all of its mass during a stage of extreme interaction with the pulsar. What was left was a crystallized core of carbon and oxygen, essentially a planetary diamond the size of Jupiter but much denser. Their density is so high that their matter behaves exotically. 
The atoms are so compressed that they are unlike anything we know of on Earth. And because it orbits like a pulse star, a neutron star that spins at lightning speed and emits regular pulses of electromagnetic radiation, this planet lives in a downright hostile region of space. What makes PSR J1719-1438b even more fascinating is that it is quite literally a cosmic oddity. Only one confirmed case of a planet like this is known. Its discovery in 2011 was so shocking that it forced astronomers to rethink what can be considered an exoplanet. Can something that was once a star become a planet? In the case of PSR J1719-1438b, the answer is yes. And the result is a world so extreme, so dense, and so incredibly compact that some scientists believe it could be the first planet made from a single piece of diamond we've ever discovered. Hey Curious Squad, before moving on answering the question, be sure to subscribe to our channel clicking on the notification bell and leave us a thumbs up so you don't miss out on our daily videos. Number 3. Kepler-16b Kepler-16b is the kind of world that looks like something out of a Star Wars movie, and it's not a gratuitous comparison. This exoplanet is famous for having two suns in its sky, precisely like the planet Tatooine. But while the setting of the galactic saga was fictional, Kepler-16b is absolutely real and is located about 245 light-years from Earth in the constellation Cygnus. This planet was the first confirmed case of a circumbinary world, that is one that does not orbit a single star as Earth does, but revolves around two stars at the same time. These stars, called Kepler-16a and Kepler-16b, form a binary system in which they both orbit each other in a delicate cosmic ballet. Meanwhile, Kepler-16b remains in an outer orbit, revolving around both like a silent spectator of that eternal stellar swing. The planet is a gas giant of a size comparable to Saturn and completes its orbit in about 229 Earth days. What's interesting is not only that it orbits two stars, but it does that so stably. For decades, binary systems were thought to be too chaotic to allow the formation of planets with stable orbits. The discovery of Kepler-16b in 2011 completely changed that paradigm. If you were standing on the surface of Kepler-16b, even though it's a gas giant and therefore has no firm ground, you might observe two different sunsets each day, one bigger, brighter, and one dimmer and reddish. The dance between these two stars generates cycles of light and shadow more complex than any terrestrial calendar. On some occasions, the two stars may be next to each other in the sky. In others, they can eclipse each other or even temporarily disappear behind the planet. This type of system opens up new possibilities for habitability in the universe. While Kepler-16b itself is not a habitable world, the existence of circumbinary planets begs the question, could rocky, Earth-like planets exist in these double environments? Could they harbor life? What is certain is that Kepler-16b taught us a valuable lesson. The universe does not follow a single script to form planets. Where we once saw chaos, we now find harmony. And where we once thought life was only possible around a solitary star, we now imagine civilizations under two blazing suns on the horizon. Number 2. 2M1510 ABB In the vast catalog of exoplanets discovered so far, very few dare to defy the most basic rules of orbital physics, such as 2M1510 ABB does. This planet not only orbits a pair of brown dwarfs, but does so in a totally unexpected way in a polar orbit completely perpendicular to the plane in which its stars rotate. That is, while the stars of the system rotate in a horizontal plane, this planet does so vertically, as if they were orbiting its poles. The system in question is composed of two brand dwarfs called 2M1510A and 2M1510B. Brown dwarfs are not normal stars. They are objects that were born with enough mass to start gravitationally collapsing but not enough to initiate nuclear fusion like a real star. For this reason, they are known as failed stars. They are dim, cold, and difficult to detect, and that's why this discovery was so surprising. 
Announced in 2025, 2M1510ABB is the first confirmed planet to orbit in a direction perpendicular to the plane of its binary system. In astronomical terms, this means that its orbit has an inclination of 90 degrees with respect to the orbital plane of the two stars that accompany it. Something like this is not only rare but also revolutionary. Why is it so important? According to classical theories of planet formation, planets form from a protoplanetary disk that surrounds young stars. That disk rotates in the same plane as the stars, so planets tend to form aligned with that plane. The fact that 2M1510ABB is not implies that something extremely unusual occurred during its formation or early evolution. Maybe a massive collision threw it off track. Perhaps a third star or planet disturbed its orbit and threw it out of frame. Or more intriguingly, perhaps this planet formed directly in that polar configuration, defying everything we thought we knew about how worlds are born. 2M1510ABB is also a giant planet. Although its atmosphere or composition is still a matter of study, its mere existence already forces astronomers to rewrite models of a planet formation in double systems. Most fascinatingly, their discovery suggests that the orbital diversity of the universe could be much more extreme than we imagine. Instead of being a rarity, there may be many worlds orbiting on inclined, twisted, crossed, or even chaotic planes. It may simply be that we have not yet discovered them. Number 1. PDS-70b and its co-orbital companion in the world of exoplanets, few objects have been as observed and debated in recent years as PDS-70b. And rightly so. This planet is not only in complete formation, but could be starring in a phenomena that, until recently, only existed in theory. Astronomers believe that PDS-70b could be sharing its orbit with another planet or massive object, an orbital oddity known as co-orbital configuration. PDS-70b revolves around a young star called PDS-70, located about 370 light-years from Earth. This system has been observed in depth by the ALMA radio telescope, the Very Large Telescope, and other state-of-the-art instruments, precisely because it offers a unique opportunity to study how giant planets form. PDS-70b is a young, hot world surrounded by gas and dust a baby planet that is still accumulating mass from its star's protoplanetary disk. But the most incredible thing came with an unexpected discovery. Astronomers detected a cloud of dust and debris located at one of the so-called Lagrange points of PDS-70b's orbit. Lagrange points are zones of gravitational equilibrium where an object can remain stable with respect to a planet and its star. In our own solar system, for example, there are Trojan asteroids that orbit alongside Jupiter at these points. In the case of PDS-70b, that dust cloud at one of the Lagrange points is not alone. The data suggests that it could be occulting a second massive object, perhaps a planet in formation, a huge protomoon, or even a co-orbital sibling. If this is confirmed, it would be the first time in history that we have detected two exoplanets sharing the same orbit around a star. This finding is so significant because it would fulfill a theoretical prediction that astronomers have debated for decades – the possibility of giant planets stably sharing orbits. While we know co-orbital asteroids, such as the Trojans on Jupiter or Neptune, have never been seen before with two planets. Of course, more observations are still needed to confirm whether that object at the Lagrange point is really another planet. But even as a massive debris cloud, it already challenges current ideas about how matter is distributed during planetary formation. PDS-70b shows us that even in the earliest stages of planetary birth, the universe is already full of surprises. Planets sharing orbits, matter trapped in gravitational equilibrium points, and orbital configurations as complex as they are elegant. And most exciting of all, this system could continue to evolve before our eyes. The universe is full of rules, and of exceptions that challenge them. These five exoplanets remind us that there are worlds with both rare and unique characteristics. If you want to learn more about why do exoplanets spin in different directions and have tilted axes, watch this video and you'll know everything.